Hello, my friends, and welcome back to an episode of Dark Souls Remastered of the Notorious BLT. Um, yeah, I can't get through this. Okay, that's fine. So, let us head into Anor Orlando proper and do what needs to be done. What needs to be done? We gotta kill a boss. We gotta kill a boss. I am, I don't wanna say I'm anticipating getting invaded, but I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised in the least. All right, let's give it uh, the old heave-ho. I believe we only need to give it one heave-ho, yeah? Is it? A, it it's going to be on the other side. Yep, okay. All right, I got to calm myself down because one of the spots that's coming up is a little nasty. As I said in a previous episode, bonfire. Praise the sun. Uh, as I said in a previous episode, it's one of the nastier parts in the game. And it's uh, a rather infamous part. Only one of you? Oh, good. That's exactly what I wanted. Oh, you scum! Get killed. Oh, he's trying to give me the poke. No pokes. Yeah. Okay, I don't have a point down. That's okay. <laughs> we don't need to have a point down. Alright, this does not open yet, but it will open eventually. What? No, this is not what I wanted. Invaded? What? Please don't be a hacker. You don't have any weapons on right now. And that freaks me out a little bit. What's your deal? I'm not taking that. I'm sorry. There could be hacked items. <sighs> Fine. It's all Brave Warrior. Great. Is he getting... What? Did he just Black Crystal? This is why you gotta love Dark Souls, man. People invade... I do want to say... this God, this is gonna sound like a, a don't do drugs in a, a, a PSA, but... That's not how I mean it. Um, <laughs> you have to be careful with invaders that drop stuff for you. Because sometimes they can be hacked items that will get your account soft banned. Yeah, I don't think lightning does a lot to you because you have lightning weapons, but we'll see. No, you don't really seem to give two shits. Ow. Hey. Oh, I hate you. Oh. Oh. No. Get wrecked, you jerk. Ugh. Such a scumbag. Alright, I forget. Do you leap off the edge? I guess sometimes you do, but not all the time. One of these guys you can spook into jumping off the edge. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be real bad. Alright, so as I said, one of the more infamous parts of this game... It's a coming. Ah! Oh, watch out for the spears. Jesus Christ. There's a strong possibility that I will 
become deceased. So, yeah, see, you can't reach me here. So there are two silver knights with great bows that are going to be shooting at us while we attempt to make our way up there. Using a shield of any kind is not recommended because they will simply push you back off the ledge that you are attempting to traverse. There's an easy way to do this with poisoned arrows. But clearly that's not what we're doing right now. Run, 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 run. Oh, Jesus Christ, no. Run. Just run. Run. You've done it. Just take your victory. There is an item over by that other knight, but we're not going to get it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's like a soul or something, so screw it. I'm not taking the chance. Praise the sun. I did it. I did it. <laughs> ah. Dark souls don't ever change. Alright. Now that we've gotten past like the most infamous part, of, well, one of the more infamous parts of this game. This is where invasions tend to happen. Tend to. <gasps> Solaire. Yes. We are very happy to see our son, bro. We are very happy and we were going to have a conversation with him. Hello, Solaire. What the hell is that? What is with all these freaking dragon eyes? Just give us, like, actual people trying to help. Oh, there you are. You've been quiet these days. Smooth summoning out there. Anytime you see my brilliantly shining signature, do not hesitate to call upon me. You left me with quite an impression. I would relish a chance to assist you. You really are fond of chatting with me, aren't you? If I didn't know better, I'd think you had feelings for me. Oh, no, dear me. Pretend you didn't hear that. <laughs> Solaire, dude. You really are. If I oh. You're the best. Don't ever change, pal. Try humanity. Need humanity. Wait, did it show me what this dude looked like? So it does. What are you wearing? Is it the chainmail? Chainmail with a. Oh, that's the, that's the the Black Knight. Sword, the Black Knight Great Sword, not not Ultra Great Sword, just Great Sword. Ah, yes, our first Silver Knigget. Get smashed. Get so smashed. This is a regular chest. Now these guys are relatively easy to parry. I say relatively. Uh, they're very similar to the Black Knights in terms of parryableness. I know there's secret things around here, but I can't quite recall where they are. There's also, like... I don't want to say it's a cheap way through, but it, it's... Instead of going through the level, there's like a, a, a skip by using a jump. I mean, an illusionary wall. You are correct, sir. And for this, you will get my upvote. Get updooted. Now, and you do get to see this from the other side of the wall. That's one of the things that's great about these games is that they actually show you, you know, that there is something there. Yeah, be careful of this. Yep, there you go. That's somebody getting eaten. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, he almost got me with the grab. Occult club. Occult weapons are very good against the gods and their servants. The dragon tooth. Uh, uh, uh. 
Created from an everlasting dragon tooth, legendary great hammer of Havel the Rock. The dragon tooth will never break, as it is harder than stone, and it grants its wielder resistance to magic and flame. And also, I don't think I have anywhere near the strength to use it. Not yet, anyway. Havel's great shield. Havel's armor and his helmet. Havel's gloves and his pants. What? Right? So this is why a lot of folks believe that that Havel knight that we see early in the game is not actually Havel. Uh, a lot of folks think that Havel came here to Orlando to kill the gods. <laughs> uh, and I kind of agree. Helm worn by Havel the Rock's warriors. Carved from solid rock, its tremendous weight is matched only by the defense it provides. Havel's warriors never flinched nor retreated from battle. Those fortunate enough to face them, or unfortunate enough to face them, were inevitably beaten to a pulp. Yeah. And then we gotta do the shield. Great shield of the legendary Havel the Rock, cut straight from a great slab of stone. This great shield was imbued with the magic of Havel, provides strong defense, and is incredibly heavy. A true divine heirloom on par with the dragon tooth. We are going to use the tooth at some point. Don't you worry. Or at least that's part of... That, that's something I would like to do anyhow. Uh, there's another door around here somewhere. Oh yeah, there it is, there it is. I open you? or No, you don't open from this side. Right. And that's it for this. Yeah, so we just got to do the stairs. Stairs it is. I don't remember where the skip is. I want to say it's... Is it? It's not done this way, is it? No, I don't think it is. It's somewhere else. That's all right. Uh, are you a mimic? You are a mimic. Get wrecked. Symbol of avarice and silver coins. I don't know what the silver coins actually say on them. Hello? There we go. Uh, let's see. Coin made of silver with a portrait of a legendary knight, King Rendell, on its face. Okay. Everything else is the same. Uh, even coins of great value in the world of men have little value in Lordran, where the acceptance, uh, accepted currency is souls. Those who dream of returning to the outside world are fond of carrying these around. <sighs> I'll get to you later. I forgot how filthy with mimics this place is. I have completely missed. Get smashed. Gold coins. Basically the exact same as all the other ones. But we might as well read it just in case. Coin made of gold with Allfather Lloyd and his white halo shown on its face. Yeah, everything else is the same. Uh, this room is what? Oh, yes, we can see down below to see the kind of things that we're going to get to. Also, dragon... Well, well less dragon heads, more drake heads. Some of them are very small. And also very just gross looking. <laughs> just so gross. I forget, what, what do you have? Hi. There you go. Try range battle. Or try giant Zweihander. <laughs> both both kind of work. Soul of a hero. We can see a Titanite demon down there. What it's doing here, we don't know. But if, if we recall, uh, I believe that they are said to spring forth from uh, demon Titanite. Is that right? I think that's right. What is this? Raising treasure ahead. Be wary of enemy. Yes, indeed. It's not over from the side. This does open. Though I don't recall exactly where this goes. Be wary of right. Oh, 
Oh shit. Yeah, these guys will mess you up, so be care <clears throat> be very careful. Now, if you are looking to farm souls, this is a pretty decent place to do it. I don't remember what's out this way, uh, aside from this archer. Stop! It's so annoying that you hit me. Just desist. Ah, uh, yes, Dragon Slayer arrows. I was going to say, I knew that they dropped something. I just couldn't remember what the heck it was. All right, now that we're all healed up. Let's go out this way and up the stairs. And we will meet a friend of ours. At least I'm pretty sure we're going to meet a friend of ours. Even though I screwed up meeting him earlier. Yeah, there's a bunch of you. I see you. They don't come to play? No? Hey, why don't you come over here, dude? You want a kung fu fight? Mmm! Get fought, son. God damn, that thing hits hard. Ooh, we got the Silver Knight Sword. I gotta put a lot of this crap away. Wait, did I? I didn't pass it, did I? What the fuck was that? Hmm. Don't nobody nobody try to mess with me, please. Oh my god, I passed it. The Silver Knights of Anor Londo guard the city using these uh, this beautiful slender weapon. Its chain attacks, in which the wielder takes great advancing steps and makes use of, use of his body weight, are deadly even in single hits. Uh, I want to say, doesn't this have? Okay, no, this is a dex weapon. Okay. For some reason, I thought that it had. Like lightning damage on it or something. But it does not. It does not. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Whatever can be done. It kind of looks like he came in through that window, huh? Ah, you again. Let me guess. Were you repelled by the Silver Knight? Oh, don't be ashamed. Tis the fate of vanguards like you and I. I'll think of something. We can overcome this together. This is quite a fix. We'll need another three. No, maybe five bodies. Hmm. Quite a fix indeed. God damn, you look so good in this remaster. This oh, fuck. Hmm. Oh, your mom. How creative. Well, there's not really anything for it. Might as well go face this son of a bitch. Instead of waiting for them to come after us when there's a bunch of dudes around. Right? That makes more sense than waiting for this person to show up and ruin our lives. Um, is it... Where did... Wait. No, I came in the other way. Hey invader, you want to come uh, fight me? You want you want a kung fu fight? Uh, I don't know what weapon or whatever I want to use. Shoot! There they are. Hello. Is that the mask of the mother? Oh, you are a douche. No, I don't think so. Ugh. I 
I'm not really a fan of this run by people and stab them in the butt thing. But then again, I am using a really slow weapon, so it makes sense. You don't really want to be on the receiving end of this thing. Because it does hit very, very hard. Alright, let's get back to where we were before we were so rudely interrupted. Honestly, if, I, if I'm going to do PvP, I should probably start using the Claymore. Because it's a much better PvP weapon than this. At least that's been my experience, anyway. But we're not too terribly worried about getting back to where we were. So it's not so bad. Uh, I mean, so long as I can remember where it is that we have to go. Which is through this door? Yeah. Yeah. But we do have to be, as the, the thing says, wary of right. Hey. Oh my god, stop it. No! Hey, come up here. Ah! There we go. Now let's get our souls and our humanity back. Get hammered. Or chopped or whatever. Okay, now for you. Mm-hmm. Alright, now let's go talk to Ziegmeier again. Well, rather, let's not talk to Zygmar. Let's just yeah. Okay, he's gonna say the same thing. We're gonna to, we're gonna go take care of Zygmar's little problem. Oh fucking hell! So the reason that he wanted so many dudes is because there's a lot of silver knights in here. If you couldn't tell. No, not that. Oh shit! Come on! No, no, roll out of it or not? Okay, whatever. Oh, fuck. I screwed it. Hmm. Delicious. Hey, you. Ah, I fucked it again. Notice also that these silver knights don't stick around. Their bodies evaporate, much like the giants. Demon Titanate. Gives you a little bit of an idea of what's going on. Only a little bit, though. Right, right. This is our, our shortcut of sorts. And now... Mm -hmm. Oh, ho! What's on your mind, friend? Wait. You defeated those monsters? Fantastic. I'm saying This knight of Katarina hereby commends you. Take this as a token of my gratitude. The tiny beings ring. But be warned. Gallantry entails great risk. Next time, give me a chance to come up with a plan. But be warned. Next time. Ah, uh, Ziegmeier. You are one of my very favorites. I didn't really understand you at first, but you're one of my favorites now. Ring made of an ancient tiny red jewel. Grants small increase to HP. Rings grant powers large and small. Their discovery and effective use can make one's journey easier. That they most certainly can. Alright, let us get to our next... Maybe not shortcut, but our next uh, area where our path kind of deviates a little bit, I guess. Oh, this is where you can skip, I think. Right? Is this where you can skip? No? I don't even know anymore. I know there's a way to do so, I just can't remember what the heck it is. Is this it? This is, uh... Yeah, that's where the Titanite Demon is. We don't want that. 
Ah, here we go. This is what we want. Yes, yes. Yeah, come up here and get it, dude. Get wrecked. You gonna come and attack me? No, oh, that's right. You just sit there. Uh, you are not a mimic, and neither is the other one, it looks like. Silver Knight stuff. Silver Knight stuff. Where are you at? Helm of the Silver Knights who protected Anne Orlando. When Lord Gwyn departed to link the fire, his knights split into two groups. The Silver Knights remained in the Forsaken Capital in the service of their goddess. Forsaken, you say? Why do they believe it is Forsaken? You may want to ask yourself. Well, we might be finding out. I... Uh, Actually, no, I, I will say this. If you really want to know, in my second season of Dark Souls, we we figure it out, essentially. Um, it, it's it's better if you figure it out on your own. I don't wanna I don't wanna you know give too much up if that makes sense. Okay. Now that we have leveled, let us go. And like I said, if you want to level up a lot, this is a good place to farm souls. There's other good places as well, but this is one of the really good ones. Because the Silver Knights, they're not so bad. I hate you. Please just die. You're not dead. Can't help but notice. What? What? <laughs> oh my god. What is this? I don't think I realize that you have an attack that does that, that blocks at the same time as the attack. That boggles my mind. Consider my mind boggled. I'm used to just being able to do that and killing it. You know, we could probably wear some slightly heavier armor now. I hate you. I hate you so much. Stupid spear man. What is this? Oh no! Oh! He's done it again! <laughs> this man is harder than all the bosses in Dark Souls. Apparently. I'll show you though. I'll show you. Oh, I'll show you. I hope. I hope I show you. Oh my god. We are going to go fight that Titanite demon as well. No worries on there, uh, on that front. What? How? Why, God in heaven, you've made me lose my stuff. These spear guys. I hate them. These, these guys, I, for whatever reason, I just, I cannot parry. Except for, like, there's one in Dark Souls 3 that I can parry. He's the only one. He's the only Spearman that I can parry. And he has to kind of set me up for it, if you know what I mean. It's not a big deal. We spent a lot of our souls before we even came here. But really, that's not the concern. The concern is the humanity that we just lost. Oh my god, why? But I mean, it was only like two, so it's not a big deal.
What the fuck? No! What? Oh my god! What the? Ugh. to deserve this. Is this the game just, like, slowing me down on purpose? <laughs> Th this dude is blocking me so hard, man. Excuse you. That's right. Get wrecked. I'll have you know I've beaten this game like three times or four times already. I hate it. Get killed, you freaking jerk. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Hit him with the tip of the sword. Good job. All right, now soon, soon, very soon, we will be needing to use... These pews are going to get in the way. Oh! Oh! Maybe I should come back. <laughs> Maybe I should come back. Because clearly I'm not ready for this. My brain's not ready for this. Oh, my what is going on? Are you okay, Brain? Are you okay? Okay. That's very heavy. I don't think we want to wear that. That is also very heavy. Mid rolls, that is unacceptable. Wait, was that? No, that's light rolls. Okay, good. That's more like it. That's more like it. I hate your spin attack. I hate so many things about you. Starting to wish I had my freaking demon great axe again. And my, my super heavy armor so I could just sit here and wail on you forever. Why, God in heaven? I don't remember you jerks performing that attack so often before. I really don't. Oh. Hi. Ah. Oh. No. Aye. Okay. Get out the room. He can't follow you. Just heal yourself. <laughs> I can't believe this. Ah. Things I've done so many times and yet I still fail miserably. Shit! I hate you. <laughs> uh, I have dodged too early, and now too late. Oh. Have I just used up all of my ability to be at all good at this game for the day. It's starting to seem that way. It is starting to seem that way. I think what we're going to do is skip some of these these jerkbag enemies and just continue on. Because clearly, 
I am not having a good time with this. I mean, well, I mean, I am having a good time, but my char <clears throat> my character is dying a horrible death. I have done it! Actually, I don't think we need to attack this man. I think we can just run right by him, yeah? Yeah, we can just run right by you. Alright, yeah, you just you guard those chests that are totally empty. Good job. You're doing some great work there, pal. Alright, let's go get ourselves a... a our, our, our souls. And then retreat. This is not... <sighs> this is not boding well for uh, dealing with Lechrec. No, sir. So, remember that we have that black eye orb. This is where you want to use it. This is, in fact, the place, but I want to clear it out of other dudes first. Not that that really matters for the invasion purpose, or the purposes of the invasion, rather. Oh, what are you doing? Hey. Yeah, get screwed. Uh, wasn't there like a pathway or a passageway up this way? Oh, there was a drop down, right. Um, so now we're almost at the boss, but here's the thing. The... There is a summon sign in here. Feels black orb quivering. Yes, yes we do. Uh, however, we're not going to do that just yet. Oh, I hate you. And these assholes do come back. So beware. Be very aware. Be be very aware? Be be aware? Be very aware? Yeah, be very aware. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys both coming, or is it just the one of you? Hey. What, how do we... Oh! Yeah, how about just one of you at a time? How's that? Yeah! They are a little bit tougher than the other giants. But they can also cast spells. Oh, actually... Yep, here we go. Wrath of Gods. Which is a spell that I, I will certainly want to get. Along with Tranquil Walk of Peace. Because honestly, there are times I just don't want to deal with PvP. And those two combined together, it may be like the worst scumbag combination, but I don't care. I really don't. <laughs> if you invade, you get, what you, you get what you deserve. If you're just invading random people, you get what you deserve. You get whatever you deserve. Uh, that is where we came in. Or, no, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You deserve whatever you get. That's what I'm trying to say. You deserve whatever you get. All right. We are going to deal with the Black Eye Orb soonish. But first, let's come down here. Uh, why? Where? Oh, uh, there we go. Yes, okay. Get that Dragon Slayer bow and the arrows. Which I probably don't have any of the stats to use. 20, no. <laughs> bow of the Dragon Slayers led by Hawkeye Goff. Or Go, if you want to pronounce it correctly, I suppose. Uh, one of Gwyn's four knights. This bow's unusual size requires that it be anchored to the ground when fired. Uses only specialized great arrows. Get killed. Ah, I missed the sound. Hey, you hop off the edge. 
You're not hopping. He's not hopping. They're stabbing. Oh my god. Oh my lord. I hate you. These demons are the worst. Freaking lightning demons, dude. Get wrecked. Ugh. Such irritating enemies to fight. Mmm, funky chunky. Alright, we got one more scumbag to deal with over here, and then we're going to talk to one of my favorite NPCs. You are a scumbag, right? Yeah, you don't leave us alone. You are actually, like, one of the worst. Because you are right before one of the greatest NPCs of all time. I have to tell you, we're interrupting our ability to speak with him. Who are you? Forge your weapons. Talk. Tis no good, but forge. Very good. I have any time. Talk. Tis no good. No one home. Everyone good. But you, friend, you talk. I no talk, but happy. But you, friend, you talk. I no talk, but happy. <laughs> One of the best NPCs in the game. Oh. Great sword of Artorius, huh? So this is one of the areas where you can ascend weapons. Manus Catalyst. <sighs> yeah, see. He also does lightning, uh, lightning stuff, and you can buy large bits from him. You can also buy the stuff, uh, like all the giant stuff. Armor of the Giant Sentinels of Orlando, made from ancient brass. Oh my god, excuse me. It also offers protection versus non-physical attacks. But due to its giant size, it is extremely heavy for humans and impedes stamina recovery. Uh, let's see. Why don't we... Yeah, let's reinforce our armor just a wee bit. Let's purchase a bunch of these large shards. Because we are going to need them. Yeah. We got to get to that chest. How do we do that? Got to come back here. Open that. Hawk ring. Hey, can I get past you, buddy? You want me by? Thank you. Oops. One of the special rings granted to the four knights of Gwyn. The hawk ring belonged to Hawkeye Go, uh, to, uh, to Hawkeye Go, who led the great archers. Boosts bow range so that arrows fly like they were shot by Go, uh, by Go's great bow, which took down high flying dragons. That it most certainly did. It can actually also increase the damage of your bow. Uh, because of the increase in range, it means that the because uh, when you shoot an arrow over great distances, the damage decreases. Having that ring means that the damage, while it still decreases, doesn't really decrease by as much. I guess is how I would put it. Alright, let's see if I can oop, if I can use this and not die a horrible death. Evading world of the Firekeeper's Killer, yes. Notice that we're blue instead of, like, red or gold or white. Try 
trying to lock out of one of these clowns. Yeah, you know what? Let's chuck lightning at you. That didn't look good. No, sir. Not did that. This is, in fact, one of my preferred ways to take these guys on is by luring them away like this. And he's dead. Hey! So we've killed Latrek. Yes. Firekeeper Soul, Ring of Favor and Protection, and some humanity. A bunch of humanity, in fact. The Ring of Favor and Protection. Boost HP, stamina, load. Breaks when removed. It is not kidding. It does actually just, like, go away when you remove it. A ring symbolizing the favor and protection of the goddess Fina, known in legend to possess fateful beauty. This ring boosts the wearer's HP, stamina, and max equip load, but breaks if ever removed. I think we're going to put it on? Because <laughs> it is actually, like, a fantastic ring. And that may mean that we can wear heavier armor now. Can we wear... Yeah, that's a good question. Can we wear Havel's pants? No, we're in mid-rolls. Damn it, I cannot be MC Havel pants. I want it to be Havel pants. Silver Knight's leggings? Yeah. That looks ridiculous, though. Shadow leggings? What else is there? We got uh, Elite Knight leggings. That puts us at mid rolls, really? Really? What about the just regular Knight leggings? Those are fine. Okay. All good, all good. All right. I don't know if I can pull this off with... Oh, no, I have 10 Estes. What am I going on about? Why did I think I had less? I've never actually done this fight solo. I'm going to give it one solo shot. And then... We're going to go away. Okay. These guys do not fuck around. And yes, there are in fact two of them. <laughs> oh. Oh, my lord. I'm trying to get them to separate a little. I I've pretty much only ever done this fight. Uh, well, no, I have done it solo once, but it was in New Game Plus. Wait, did I do it solo? I think I did it solo in New Game Plus. Uh... And it was still very difficult. Whoa! That's a lightning bolt. And I was also wearing extremely heavy armor. Had like 20 Estus charges. You know, maybe I just have to kill... Oh, maybe I just have to kill Smo first? I don't want to... Oh my god! He's so fast. Ornstein, dude, stop chucking lightning bolts and, like, get on me. Am I just gonna have to... Ugh! Am I just gonna have to kill Smo first? Oh. Don't make me kill Smo first. I don't wanna. Oh, shit. Oh! 
Oh my god. Uh! <laughs> Holy shit. Where are you? There you are. Come here. Oh, fuck. No! Run, you fool. Oh my god, am I dead? No, I'm not, surprisingly enough. Oh. Hey, ya, uh, holy hell. Stop that. Ooh. Okay, would you just not do the thing you're doing? Please? Hey. Oh, that was some serious tracking. Run away. Oh. You scared me there. <laughs> Please don't. For the love of God. Hell's blazes. Ornstein, you, you must come here, my friend. Oh, yes. Hey! Oh! Dude! You're so mean! Stop! This is too much. Oh, no! Oh, jeez! Never mind, he can do a move that, like, skewers you, but I think that may be in his, like, ascended form. Oh! Ow. Oh my god, this is so bad! Now, any damage you do to these guys in this area doesn't carry over to the next phase, I have to tell you. Um, and what I mean by that is that once you kill one, the other one powers up and goes to full health. So, just, you know, be careful. Come here. Oh! Power up. Oh, I didn't think I would even get through the first phase. But now we gotta fight Super Smo. Mr. Sumo Man. Oh! Do your freaking slam of the bum. Actually, you know what? Don't. Because it hurts a lot when you do that in a very large area of effect. I don't know if you have any double attacks. When I, what I mean by that is attacks where you have a follow-up. I missed. Please hit that. Thank you. Yeah, you can still use the Broken Pillars to get him to, to not destroy you. What's he doing? He's doing the charge. He's doing the charge! Oh no! Stay frosty, stay frosty. Oh! Yeah! Get smushed. Your charge. No? You do that instead? Oh no, he's doing a follow-up. Oh, but I stopped him. Okay. 
Hey, come on, buddy. Okay. You gonna attack me there, buddy? You wanna slam that hammer on my face? No? Slam the hammer! Slam it. I missed. I already dodged. I'm not sure which. Woo! Oh! My god, no! Get away from him. Quickly, drink. Oh, shit. Oh! Just stay calm. Just stay calm. Almost. We so we've got him. I'm almost certain. Yeah! I cannot believe I did this on my first shot. What? Insanity. Absolute insanity. I did not think I was going to pull this off. At all. Alright, so let's just take a quick peek at this and then we're going to stop. So we got Guinevere. I miss you. <laughs> God damn it. Gwyn. And then... The Firstborn? Hmm. But there is somebody else here. Who's part of Gwyn's family. Somebody who I used to not like. And my mind was changed. Or rather, I should say, I realized that I was incorrect. Basically, this person was just doing what they were asked. Alright, we can't, because I don't have any humanity. Yeah, let's go to 26 Endurance. We like having a lot of... Uh, so I just want to point out something. We had that small elevator for people that, about our eye size. And then there's this big one for giants. Giants like Gwyn and his, his family. Uh, because those who absorb very powerful souls tend to become very big. Hmm. What's this? Ooh. Oop. So this is the armor that Latrec wore. Armor of Latrec the Embraced, representing the goddess Fina's love. The goddess's arms wrap around it as if to embrace the wearer. During his solitude, he forsook everything, for he believed in the goddess's love for him. Yeah. Latrec, maybe not as much of a, much of a jerk bag. Well, it, yeah, he is a jerk bag, but maybe not as much of a jerk bag as he may have seemed at first, I guess. Do we want to pop some more souls and level a little bit more? I think we do. Hush you, stomach. I fed you. Yeah, let's let's go level a little. Yeah. All right, folks. We're going to pick this up next time. I hope you all did enjoy this episode. And if you did, you know what to do. That is me for me, Notorious BLT. I hope you have a fantastic day. And I will catch you all next time. Bye-bye, folks.